Hello and welcome back to my let's play on Total War Free Kingdoms with Gongdu, not Zhangyan. Gongdu on Legendary Difficulty. Well, last time we left off, we had actually triggered. I'm still going to keep calling it Realm Divide because it does div divide the realm. Um, and we noticed that Cao Cao, uh, Sun Jian, and the Kingdom of. Was it Da or something? Or De? Um, became the free factions to declare themselves emperor. Oh yeah, I don't actually know them yet, so I don't even have to see it up here. Uh, Kingdom of Ba, that's the one. <laughs> what did I say? D Da though. Anyway, so that was free. Um, Sun Jian's still alive, by the way, in this campaign. Um, okay, so yeah, that's what we're basically doing now. We also have almost a rebellion happening here. This population with zero people in it, somehow not happy with their current state of affairs. Um, we're running this army over there to just kind of keep the peace. Although I could let it rebel and just deal with it afterwards. That probably would be easier, but faction support's coming up my, my way, so that's going to be okay. We took the weapon craftsman just now. I'm downgrading that because I don't need to actually keep it up. And I just took this town as well, which I do need to switch a Rooney some things in. Crony of the headquarters, which I definitely don't want. That's such a weird building. Plus public order, but minus public order adjacent commanderies, which actually isn't helping with that other place either, I imagine. So that's definitely going away. Um, income from peasantry, which means this isn't going to stay. That is definitely going to stay, though. I guess I'll keep it. Do I want to... I think I'm actually not going to build something. I have several assignments I can do, so let's shove some people in here. You, Dongman, can do that. And then I'll have Pengqing can also do that. And next turn we'll have some buildings to be built here. Uh, and then we have one more, which will be... Here I have one. Where else am I building loads of shit? Down here I am, to be fair. I have one person here. I can put one more in here, that makes sense. So that'll be Shantu Gong. So he's got something to do. Sorry about that. Got interrupted. Okay, so I was yeah doing assignments and shit. That's all good. We, we got it all figured out. Uh, oh, I've actually done some particular research. I can actually get further now. What do I want here? I was waiting for the more expensive one, so that's that one because it doesn't give yeah it doesn't give trade influence, but I get a lot more money from straight up industry, which probably would be worse in the long run, except for the fact that we only have like well we have three possible trade agreements, but we currently only have two. We have one more available with her. Oh, we have more. Oh, I, I trade with Cao Cao. Four seventy two. It's actually a very small amount, probably because his um, trade influence is a lot better better than mine. 666, I love it. Okay, how difficult would that one be to acquire? Because that's probably a good one to trade with. Ooh. That's not worth it. Um, Because, yeah, I don't want it with her because I'm about to declare war on her. So it'd be, be between, well, actually, what would yours be? I don't really want to... That's better, but do I get it with the kingdom away? Which would mean that I'm going to expand southwards first, which is totally fine by me, because that was kind of what I wanted to do anyway, despite kind of being over here already. Um, he fucking despises me, but what else have we got, by the way? Oh, we can... Oh, no, we already had coalition. Military alliance. Confederate. Ooh, that's a thing we can do now. I'm assuming... That's one of those things we can't actually influence in any way, shape, or form, though. Okay. Oh my god, that's so close. That's actually really close. Military strength and strategic situation, opinion, major threat. Oh my god, okay. Actually, if I get a little bit stronger, he might. if I just build another army right now, he'd probably do it. Do it. Um. Anyway, yeah, I guess it's very expensive, though. It's going to take a long time to make that money back, especially since we probably have, yeah, a lot of corruption now. This actually isn't really even worth it for a while, I think. Or ever, for that matter. Same goes for here or any other place where we have one of those buildings available. 4800 bucks, And we make back, like, since we have corruption, it's 100 bucks, but 40% corruption, which is probably going to keep going up as well. So let's say 50%. So we make 50 bucks from that, so 48 means we need to take six, nine, it's gonna take 96 turns for that to make it make its money back to me. Uh, plus actually the however long it takes to actually make the building, seven turns lost as well. So it would actually be 
103 turns before I make my money back, which just isn't really worth it. Uh, I wasn't going to build anything there. Uh, yeah, same goes for here, unfortunately. Ooh, that's besieged. Where is this? This one over here. All oh, right, that's that's me besieging it. <laughs> All right, I knew that. So yeah, we don't actually have much to build right now. That one would probably be worth it, but but but. Okay. Um, so I guess actually I'm gonna keep my money. I could now perhaps make an army. Oh right, no, we had the trade thing that was still discussing. Hold on, sorry. Uh, so yeah, I think we'll, we'll do it with, with him. It's not the greatest trade agreement. Five. Ooh, that's a thing we can actually look at. Well, I don't know everyone, but I can still kind of see three. Okay, there's only two people that are my strength. Uh, and one of them is five, one of them is three. So I could be one, two, four, or lower. Interesting. Anyway, yeah, we'll get the trade with the kingdom away. Start that off. We're actually bordering him over here. Oh, that's the trade port, right? So we're not going to go to war with you. I'm going to finish up my wars around here. Probably keep that army around here somewhere, and then I'm going to start s just expanding this way. For the moment, at least. Probably stay friends with Liu Biao for the moment, or maybe we'll attack him. Maybe we'll surround Tatsa. Oi, 1.2. Um, I can't. I already have food trade with you, right? Hmm. Hmm. I wonder if I could make a really good deal if I did this plus the food, but eh, probably not. Let's just take 118 bucks. Or make him like me more by giving, or by not taking 118 bucks, probably better. Alright, so there's our trade. With the enemy. Uh, and I think I'll recruit another army, to be honest. I'll do it here. Who the fuck are we gonna recruit in here? Uh, Chang Zhu Bao. Chang Zhu Bao. Sorry. You don't have any extra expertise, which is kind of sad, actually. What abilities have you got? I don't care about the abilities, actually. What am I, what am I saying here? Uh, oh, I, no, I don't want you. You're, you're fucking rank lass. Uh, you are actually pretty good. Minus 15% of revenue upkeep as well, which is always nice. Um, you have Condemn. You have, whoa, you have all the abilities already. Hold on. Guan Jin. Who the fuck are you, man? Literally just got... Okay, interesting. Um, did I do that? Surely not. He must have come to me like this. <laughs> Devoted student. Okay, well, you're pretty good. So I might recruit you. I'll keep you uh, keep you in mind, my friend. You would be a cavalry ranged, but not ranged. There's a melee. You don't have the charge bonus, so you'd probably just be an infantry commander. That's fair. Okay, Guan Jin. You know what? I'm actually just going to seal the deal, I think. Unless there's someone else I really need to look at. But I think he's probably one of the highest levels I've got. Yeah. No. Um, Guan Jin is fine. Gonna have to change all those units out. I guess I must have used them at some point. Alright, who do you like? You like Qing Gan, Chu Fang, Tihi, Ji Chi. Actually, uh, apparently the X is like a C, like a S, like an S, I mean. So Ji Shi. Yeah, that makes sense. I don't know why it makes sense to me, but it does. Ji Shi. Uh, and Chu Mo. Alright. Chumo. You have all the abilities already as well. How the hell did you make that happen? I guess these random people just kind of come to me like that. Chumo. You've got that available and you're almost there as well. How many ranged things have you got? You got that one right there. Right there. And you got... No, that's not... Well, that's still good, but... You got some good shit. Who were the other people that he liked? He liked Chin Gan. Who has the research rate shit? Um, okay, we've got that one for ranged. And we got that one, the main one. Did the other guy have that? Yes, I think these trade trees are actually the same, aren't they? Yeah, they are. That one isn't, though. See, I knew there was a difference. 
Uh, you are no, you're definitely not good. I don't even know if you if he wanted you to be honest, but yeah, you don't look particularly good. So let's let's take um this boy here. I think or Chufang, no, Chingan. Would I rather have these two abilities already or these two things already? You're scholarly, I guess that's the thing to look at. Because you're going to be my ranged commander, so you've got a little bit of extra t uh, extra um, cunning. Coordinated, arrogant, and populist. Uh, I think the other one might actually be better, even though his things weren't particularly great either, to be honest. Melee evasion's pretty good. Yeah, alright, Chingan. Fuck it. I'll recruit Chingan in here. Go away. Not you. Chingan. Welcome. And then finally, we need a... I need a healer. Zhao Fangjing is also not very happy, which makes that a good investment. Or Yi Gong, Or Bei Pu. There's a lot of options here, actually. Okay, let's go through them again. Uh, we've got... Zhao Fangjing. There you are, you unhappy lady. You've got some range shit, which is already a waste, so you're probably not it. You have you got yeah, you have got all three abilities, but that's not even necessarily a good thing. Uh, I've also been told actually that these healers are generally the best calf commanders because they get access to the Vanguard Cav as well, but eh. Okay, the other one was Beipu, who's also not happy. He's got the charge bonus already, so he would be a good good calf commander. Which I guess actually, yeah, we've got we've got range, we've got melee infantry, so yeah, we do need calf commander. So, you're actually my number one choice right now. And it was Yi Gedong. We don't need that, so it's gonna be um, Beipu, unless your traits are fucking horrible. Nope, those are pretty good. Not a lot of instinct or anything, but that's alright. Uh, have you got like massively better traits? No. And the lady. Wait, did we go past? Where the fuck she gone? There you are. Uh, she is not very good. Cautious immediately sucks. Okay, so it's gotta be Yi Gedong. No, not him. It's gotta be Bei Pu. Bei Pu. Cool. Alright. Get this man in here. Welcome. Alright, so you're my melee infantry commander, you're my ranged commander, you're my cavalry commander. So let's start with melee. So we wanna get a whole load of fucking these boys. Don't know if I've got the money for oh not you. For more than, much more than this, but I can literally just get these units and that's it. Oh no, I can't even get that one. Well that's fucking shit. Okay. That's fair enough. This army will get redu uh, recruited slowly, and that's okay. What right, I have no more assignments available. Our income is going down the fucking drain. This place is almost rebelling, like I said. I'm gonna run in there and that will be fine. You've taken that this turn, you've taken this this turn. This 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 this, 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 this turn. You're besieging that, they might just sell you out right now. Uh, I'm not gonna do this yet. Stop. I already tried to make him sally out, but they said, nah, mate. No interest for me. Oh, for fuck's sake, you still got more. <laughs> Maybe I'll take peace after. Well, actually, no, I'll just pick, take peace right now, to be honest. Maybe I can even get his jade mine. Kingdom Away requested Kong Rong to join their war. Kong Rong commanded the vassal to join their war. You want Shu... Oh, for fuck's sake, this timing is horrible. I should have taken a piece. Okay. So I'm at war with... Oh, fuck. Well, it's a good thing I've recruited an army here. Wait. You requested her to join the war. Oh, that's her Yi. Never mind. Sorry. I, thought that was... I saw yellow just as the, like the last time. I was like, oh, that's probably me, but no, it's not. It's like, we're not actually at war, though. Faction developments. What was that? This one. Red new upkeep. Oh, that's pretty sweet. Okay, so this one we actually need for our mission. Um, and these other ones, you know, but these still open up positions as well, which is nice. But I f I, there might be other shit that's still pretty good. 40% 40, 40 income from industry is pretty solid. Um, what else we got? Trade influence. That's not really enough to make it worth my while. Character salary, 50%. 
I think I checked that. That was okay. The Sleeping Dragon. Great Zug Liang, self-styled Sleeping Dragon after the rich near to his home, offers his considerable talents to Li Bei. Oh, okay. I thought it was coming to me. <laughs> oh, it's, no, it's minus two. Oh. Run! Unless I literally want to re make it rebel. But the rebellion will happen down here, which is kind of awkward. So let's just make it happy. Alright, it's getting a lot better now. Fan bloody tastic. Um another assignment. Jeez. Gee, where's Batman? Okay, my income went up a lot. Right, so I was looking at salary. So that would actually save me 850 bucks. Which is not bad. Um were there any other big one income ones? How, also, how long is this now? Still two turns. 40% income from industry is not bad, but it's nowhere near 850 from the character salary, which is only going to get better and better over time as well. So is the income from industry, to be fair. But 10% replenishment is pretty sweet, but meh. Yeah, I mean, I, I, I want most of those things at some point, but administrative positions aren't as good in this game. Income from all sources, 10% is not bad. These take how long? Five turns. Um, no, I think I'll, um, take another big in. Still need a lot of buildings unlocked as well, but I'm not too worried about that. Food increase would be nice as well. So we'll take, um, the character salary one. Seven turns. Public order will be okay as well, I suppose. Okay. Okay, hold well, on. I actually want to build a building, the army too. But I guess I'm not that much in a rush. Uh, this is, yeah, definitely food province. So grain storage here. We want that one. We want the long one. And I demolished a bunch of shit. So this is uh, income from peasantry more than food, but that still means it's gonna be a food problem, so. That one, please. Wait, oh, that's demolishing in the same province. Right. And I'm out of money. Fair enough. Right, can I reach this army? Yeah, I definitely should be able to reach it again if it doesn't run away, which it didn't. Perfect, so we'll kill them off. And then we'll get peace with Yuan Shu. Oh. Um, well, since you don't have anything and I don't want to piss off Yuan Shu, although you're not friends, but you're still one of his generals, I'll release you. Yeah, I'll take the money. Hey, Oathsworn. Oh. That's one of the other enemy people, though. Okay, I guess because the other people dislike each other, so they can't be Oathsworn to each other. Right, uh, so how about that piece, Yuanshu? Oh man, that's really weakened a lot. Despite me absolutely fucking beating him all over the damn place. Actually, hold on, how much money would you even be able to pay me? Yeah, that's not gonna go well, is it? There's already pretty big jumps. How much food? He wants food quite badly, though, so I could actually give him... Nah, last couple there were too much, I think. That's a big, pretty big jump right there. Oh, I meant to do 50. Holy shit. 35, there you go. 735 for 8 food and peace. There's not much else I could get out of him, so yeah. How much money do you have? That's not a lot. I'll take this. Get your fucking army out of my land. Right. Uh, you want to call... Uh, no, sorry, you want to confederate yet? No, nope, not quite. Because I am building another army now, so I'm, I imagine I'll be getting closer and closer to this. Oh, it's going further away. Of course it is. Fair enough. Alright, my income's pretty solid. So you've done that, which means now we're kind of at an at a, at a, at a interesting position where I don't know what to do because we're bordering Liu Biao now, which means, wait, can I trade with you? No, I can't because I'm the trade available, but otherwise, yes. Um, nor do you actually have trade available. We're already selling you food. We don't like each other? No, we don't. To be fair, no one likes me, so... War trust is against our friends. Who the fuck's your friend? You want shoe, you're trading with him, so I imagine that's your mate. How does that how is he your mate? Also, you own shit down here, so I think war with you is definitely coming soon. So maybe now? War of Liu Biao. I mean we're in the right position to do it. Do it. Um 
So you can go down here, take that, and then start going this way while you take out all the shit around here. We're just preemptively putting an army over here. Getting suspicious, are we? Well, rightfully so, I'd say. So we definitely still want yellow turban archers rather than men in the forest, I think. They're just not good enough. They fire quite a bit faster. But to pay basically double for them is just not really what I'm all about. I don't really want to recruit them for it. Yeah, I guess fuck it. Let's not do that. We'll just... I mean, yeah. It, it looks better in the way I want it to look, right? Because I want the two trebuchets at the start, because that's what I've got for every other army except for this one. And all the other ones have it at the, at the beginning, basically. But I just kind of messed that up, didn't I? Oh, for fuck's sake, I peaced out. Ah! I'm an idiot! Damn it, I needed that place. Oh, I'm, I made it. I made a real fucking mistake there. Yeah, that was... That was not smart. Shit. Okay, no. I'm not gonna be able to do that. I needed that. I really needed this place. Because now I'm kind of just middle of fucking nowhere. I can't declare war on him yet, I'm pretty sure. Well, eight turns must be close to over now, at least. I don't really want to declare war on Zheng Zhang. Oh, that's Gong Shenzhan now. Oh man, that makes it even more that I want to take that, because then I can just take Zheng Zhang out over here. Well, I can still do that, I suppose. But this part is combined with the one over here, which is owned by Wang Lang. Well, it's no, it's Jian Li Ting. Ugh, fuck, well, at least I'm not bordering Gong Shenzhan, I suppose. Is Gong Shenzhan at war with you? That's a question. No. Who is Gong Shenzhan at war with? Do we not? We haven't met him yet, so we can't check. Even though we technically see that land as his, but we haven't actually met him or his faction beyond that. Well, you're gonna go down this way and probably murder uh, Zheng Zhang in that case. I'll probably take this as well. That's even. Well, maybe this was a good thing. I'd have liked to have at least taken that, but eh, whatever. It's not too big a deal. Alright, we have five people unhappy now. You're even unhappy. Actually, no, yeah, you're just the person who I just recruited into his army, so of course you're unhappy. Uh, I need to exchange these guys for Cav as well. Oh, yeah, lots of people are also telling me that I have got Cav that I can still unlock through this. I don't know where it is, but the Chargy Boy Cav. Trying to hide from me? You fucking can't. Oh my god, where is it? Is it in here? Pretty sure it isn't. Watch me be wrong. There it is. Uh, no, that's not it. What the? Is it all the way back here? One of the easiest units to recruit. The White Wave Horsemen. Yeah, apparently a lot of people said the White Wave Horsemen are actually quite good. Looking at their stats, they are okay. Unless they have like some kind of special thing about them. They're not like... Um, they're just like normal, they're average speed. They have a shield, which is nice, but not a huge deal. Their melee attack, the melee attack rate is normal, but their armor piercing damage is kind of low. Charge bonus is pretty solid, but doesn't even bar 300. Although, to be fair, not many units do. It's, yeah, it's alright. It's 200 bucks, though. It's a pretty expensive unit. The White Wave Veterans, they're quite good as an offensive unit, which well, they've got a shield as well. Anyway, um, yeah, I guess I'll get that at some point, but I'm not too worried about it. So now we get a couple of these. Well, oh, we can't anymore. Broke. Still making 4.4 grand a turn, though, so that's nice. Yeah, more and more people are getting unhappy, but unless they like get to the point where they would actually just straight up leave, I can either just fire, either just fire them or just uh, give them some items. I think I'm more inclined to fire. I don't think I'll need that many people anymore, to be honest. Oh shit, what's going on here? Are you at war? No, your mates then, I guess? What are you doing there? Kingdom of, no, it's Kingdom of Wu, isn't it? No, Kingdom of Wei. Okay, so hold on, you are trading with him. You're just kind of hanging out on this door doorstep. Are you his vassal? No, you're not. Well, nice friendly visit, I'm sure. Uh, okay, so yeah, you're going down that way. 
Um, that's, yep, unhappy, I'm aware. Okay, so yeah, I've still got to choose what to do with you. So I guess if we're going to go to war with Liu Bei, then yeah, you're going this way. Uh, Liu Biao, sorry, not Liu Bei. You're going, going down there. So we'll stick in there for the moment. Uh, you're going to go this way, and then you're going to go through here, and then we're going to go that way. Alright. Sounds good, she. Oh, well. I was on my I was just on my way to see you. Oh, oh that's that twat over there. <laughs> what the fuck? Look, I wasn't gonna take your tans, but you're gonna force my hand. Holy shit. I guess that's the one who owns that porto or that um, mine over there, so that works out okay as well. Guess I'm going further east than I expected to. Okay. Uh, Zheng Zhang declared war on me. Kong Rong commanded their vassal to join a war against Kong Shenzhan. Ling Yushu declared war on me. That's the person there. And then that one declared war on me as well. Yu Juan Li Ting. Okay. Why Juan? I don't know. I'll start over in the west, I guess. That was initially the plan anyway. So let's just do that. I guess he could come up that way and attack me, but yeah. Fair enough. I don't want to let uh, Zheng Zhang go through and attack me wherever she wants either, so... Uh, everything takes two... well, these take two turns, so let's just get that one. Let's keep going that... upgrading that right now. And this was monies and food. Food from monies. Food, money from food. There you go. And I've spent all my money. Right, have I got anything to attack right now? I don't think I do. That's the next turn, and you guys are all pieced out, so... Unless I'm... Actually, who are you? Are you allied to anyone? No, you just have got a couple of vassals, and you're friends with the Kingdom of Wei. You're at war with He Yi, which makes me wonder if He Yi is close to you there. Either way, do we start trespassing? We just declare war right away. Uh, you need to actually replenish a little bit more, so never mind. You are done replenishing. Sail away, boy. Oh. Never mind. Right, how much do we get from Garrison here? Ten. But it looks like everything is evened out right now, so we can actually get out of here and not rebel anymore. Everyone's fully replenished except for that unit and him a tiny bit, so I'm gonna just run for now. Make sure I get here in time. Fucking hell, that mountain ruins me. Um, yeah, it's faster just to jump in the river there, so let's do that. And you need to get more units. Oh, they're really properly recruiting units here, aren't they? I'm doing the same, so that's okay. Fair enough. Okay. Uh, yep. A bit scared about that situation there, but... Oh, it's, an oh, it's actually not happy. Oh, I must add two from characters. Well, it should still be okay. Fuck it. If it does rebel, I can always just exempt it for a bit. Plus 23. Holy fuck. Oh, wow. Okay, never mind. That could, I actually lose my food to the point where I go food rupt. Which is a word I just invented and means bankrupt, but you don't have any more food. I thought it was pretty clever, but I'm pretty sure I didn't have to explain it. I'm, I imagine you guys got it. Let's just move on, shall we? Bit surprised with just three declarations of war in a, in a row there. Looks like they were working together or something, but as far as I'm aware, they're not. A little bit surprised by that. I'd imagine Zheng Zhang's got a pretty big army there, plus Zheng Zhang herself is there. But I'm attacking her with Gongdu, so. Peace Treaty with Kingdom of, Kingdom of Wu, I don't like that. I just guess to be murdering each other. Uh, okay. Fantastic. Oh, right, yes, we have another assignment also. Do we actually need anything here still? Not really, if I'm going to do that right now, so let's put them elsewhere. Already got two here. I don't really need them in Baxi anymore. Definitely need someone here. I've already got two people here. Then here? Yeah, we still got shit to do here. Alright, you. Okay, I'm a little bit out of supplies. Wait, was I not in my own territory there? Surely I was. Hostile territory. Are you kidding me? I was actually not in my own territory. Well, fuck it. That is not a large army, which means either her army already left, or... 
Maybe. Oh. Oh, I think the same actually goes for um, Dong Zhou. He can't actually ask or demand surrender. Okay, I'll uh, just continue to see if I can start taking Trisha immediately. I wonder where she is though. A little bit worried about that. As far as I'm aware, she only owns one town, unless she still owns something up here somewhere, but that seems unlikely. Um, right, yeah, we did that. Character developments, we got a couple of people available. I don't really have the money for this right now, so let's hold off on that for now. Already did that. Need to build something here. And nope, not that. Take this cheapo building so I can get some units recruited right now. Uh, and then two spearmen. And then the last two units will be the two trebuchets next turn, probably. Okay. For the first time in this fucking... Since I played this campaign, or this game in general, I'm going to move my camera so I can actually see what's going on. Can I land this turn? Oh, I can. Hello. Uh, and you're going this way. You land this turn as well. No. Alright, well, doesn't matter actually. We just land next turn. Or this turn, but in force marks sense, we attack it next turn. Alright. Mr. Liu Biao. You got another thing coming. Do I attack that first or is town? That's his capital. Uh, let's go this way. I might actually not be able to reach because I will be... I'll have less movement next turn. Eh, I think I'll still be able to reach it. But yeah, if you're starting your own territory, I think you do start with more movement. Alright, mass fucking trespass. You are getting less and less happy. You're pretty shit anyway. And you're 52 years old. You know what? Zhao Feng Ying. You can f fung your ass out of here. Get out of here. Alright, who else is on the fucking verge of being super unhappy? You. Eight. Gong Yizi. You're not so bad, actually. But you're getting fired anyway. Gong Yizi. Man, are you family? Get out of here. 48 year old as well. And I think that's it for the super unhappy people, but there are a couple others that'll probably get there as well. It seems to be spreading. I could get the satisfaction uh, reforms, but I'm just not really too interested in that right now. See, so yeah, an extra mass attack on Libya will take three towns in a single turn. Well, actually, if I can auto resolve those, but we'll see. Uh, we're gonna hold off on doing anything here. Are you, you're not a vassal, are you? You're not a pussy, are you? Oh, shit. No, that's just a confederation, right? It's not actually an alliance, I think. Well, if you want, she joins in, so be it, I suppose. Although there's still an army that's running around here somewhere from him from before, but we'll see. Okay, let's end the turn. You think Liu Bi knows something's up? Oh, we're selling out. Uh, I think I'm just gonna auto sold that one. I wanna fight this? I mean... Seems a bit pointless. Um, if I fight it myself, there's a good chance I can make sure that... Oh, he's 100% chance he's gonna get captured. <laughs> okay. Uh, yeah, if I fight it myself, I'm, I'm probably gonna be able to make sure I can get everything and nothing gets away. So let's do that. So I can definitely get the town without having to auto resolve another battle next turn, which... Even against like 100 men, it'll still cost a lot of men, my men. Because they're inside of a town. So that'll be one of the free f uh, fights we just started. I wonder if Zheng Zhang is just not recruited because they couldn't afford her. Like, they just literally can't afford to recruit her because she's quite expensive and they've only got one town. Probably out of food and everything as well. I don't know. Guess we'll see. Or maybe she was actually in a force, but she was up there and she got killed by Gong Shinzan. That's always possible too. Take this nice big piece of flat land. This is the army that's still... Oh yeah, no, it's never going to get the explosive shots. I forgot about that. Uh, no 
Get rid of the deployment, unfortunately. Do you even have any archers? I don't know. Whatever. These students have had since the start. Incredibly expensive. Not very useful. <laughs> I think, honestly, these ones are just better. Not better, but just more useful. Yeah, good, uh, good way to explain it. Oh, you got regular abilities too. Alright, they're waiting for the reinforcements, fair enough. Yes, certainly. Alright. Uh, oh, they actually do have some calves, so I gotta be a little bit wary. I think I'm actually just gonna hang back. I'm assuming no one's gonna want a jewel. Oh, wow, he actually wants to jewel him, okay. Oh, wow, okay. Well, I know he's a champion and all, but that's unexpected. Uh, in that case, let's get you up there. We got our free abilities now with you, don't we? Yes, we do. We'll do the old strat again. Is he gonna challenge me? Yes, he is. All right. Get the fuck back here! Okay, now the duel's gonna start, and now the other units are still getting in position, so the duel's literally gonna be every, like super far away from everything else. Or at least far enough away that it's not gonna matter. Where the fuck do you guys think you're going? Are you guys not hidden? Oh shit, no you're not. Uh, get hidden quick. Okay, we're hidden. Except they don't seem to care, they're like... I fucking smelt you. <laughs> oh shit, no, 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 they're turning back. Stay hidden. There we go. <laughs> Gotta block him. Oh, we won the first bout. Fantastic. Some melee evasion going. Should I use all my buffs too? Yeah, fuck it. That one at least. Fucking gonna slaughter him with that. Here he comes. Ah, uh, boom. And then just like one attack and he's dead. Definitely gonna get it before 43 seconds, I imagine. Don't even need to heal. There we go. I was gonna say, I don't really want to use my ability if I don't have to. Right, nice. Good start. Oh. Shots fired! Shots fired! Good shots fired, too. One or two of them were good. Alright, there's no one else to threaten me here anymore, so let's fucking go, boys! Actually, I want you to kill the cab off. Just go towards the middle, everyone, so we can use the abilities and actually evolve everyone in the abilities. I feel like nine dudes on the charge there, that's pretty impressive. Route everyone. Got my heal as well, in case I uh, start getting into some kind of trouble. But I'd like to actually use that ability for everyone to... Let's get over here. Do I just get my cav in here too? I feel like I should. It's a party! There. I need to get my cab over here soon anyway, because I need to make sure I can kill everything off. The only threat we really have is their cab. I don't know, I'm not really worried about it. Boom. Yeah, fuck, it's not sun. Funny enough, there's actually a unit that's gonna kinda guard them there. Is that unit getting shot by me? Oh no, it's just getting. Okay. I thought it was getting shot by my archers, but it's obviously not. She kind of needs to heal. Oh, we actually routed it though by shooting at it, so that's pretty good. Uh, keep killing it. Actually, you know what? If they want to charge me, don't be stationary. Ah, oh, they fucking stationaried up. Oh, and then they got shot by artillery at the same time. That was rough. They're like, okay, we're fine. We, we, we became stationary. We're going to be okay. Get shot in the back by a fucking artillery piece. And that unit's getting shot just before I'm charging in there. Solid shit right here. Yeah, Wu Dai Shu Peng. I must say, 
I agree. Alright, let's get that heal going now. Oh my god, I instantly saw their health just like fly up. That was madness. Madness? This is actually Sparta. That's China. Joke. Fighting hilarious. Holy shit. Okay, someone make sure this man dies. You too. Make sure of it. I will not accept disappointment. Or something. I don't know. That sentence doesn't really make any sense. I don't know I do That's, actually, he's gonna be able to get it off. Oh, yeah, I killed a bunch of dudes. Nice. Okay, you guys are definitely gonna be able to kill him, no problem. Five seconds laid down. Fuck's sake, you didn't kill him. I should have been like two minutes later or whatever. So I can give it this, alright? Nice. Alright. This is the most important thing, so we can move on. We can move on. You kill him, or it, that, whatever. There's still a cav unit. Oh, they're basically dead too. Oh no, what's that? It's one archer. I think we'll be okay. Wipe him off the fucking earth. There's three dudes remaining, which I'm pretty sure means that the army is just straight up dead. We are gonna still have to take it next turn, but at least it won't be by an actual battle. It'll just be given to me. Here you go, sir. Here is your town. Please make yourself at home, as it is now, in fact, your home. Nice, a little bit of money too. What do you got? A Confucian Sage. Is it Confucian or Confucian? It's Confucian, right? I don't know. Oh shit. Got them units because you're part of that faction. Uh, this is actually not bad. Then again, I don't really need more items, but this is pretty good. And I don't really care for you. Plus, your faction's gonna die in a second, so... Execute it. I'll take the recruitment, because 9 income is horrible, and also I need the actual... Um... <laughs> you're still alive, and you click away, and he's back, he's dead. Um... I need to replenish because there's more battles coming. Oh! Wait, no, I was trading with you. You fuck. I need that money. Alright, well, this campaign is going completely... I'm not worried about any of these wars. It's more than... The one thing I'm worried about... Is that I'm gonna have to keep expanding into locations I didn't really want to expand into. Fuck me, my income reduced by a lot of money there. Um, oh yeah, so there's this army right away. And another problem is that I guess since he's not friend or is not enemies of the Kingdom of Wei or Tsatsao, he's actually just gonna be able to march through and attack me at my most vulnerable position. It's a bit awkward to be honest. Requested Zhang Zhang to join the war. Isn't she dead though now? Surely she is. Surely Kong Rong declared war on me. Man, Kong Rong Gong, we could have been cool. We could have been friends. We were actually friends for a while. Join the coalition. Oh no. A steed to rival the ages. A new mount. Sweet. Show me it. Oh my god, it's a red elite. Instinct. Bit shit, unfortunately, but. What have you got right now? A brown pharaoh bread? Well. Um, it's even slower, but more mass. Uh, should I give it to someone who's dueling? Have I got any good mounts for my duelists? Jewel du boys. You've got expertise mounts. You've got a different one, so I guess I could give it to you. If I do so, you'll lose. Oh no, you still keep that as well. Oh, you oh my god, you can actually get some free skills. I don't know, you'll be on 92 of that, but still. Do I give you a red elite? A bit of a waste on you, perhaps. Wasted. Uh, oh God, every time I see that, I'm like, fuck me, I forgot this guy became worse. Because of something that was completely out of my control. Here, you take the red elite, fuck it. It makes sense, right? Give the big boy the elite mount. Then I've got a resolve mount, which I'll give to any of my other generals, basically. Oh, no, I need to turn. Okay, never mind. Okay, so the awkward thing is here that I'm right close to just going ham on Liu Biao. Liu Biao. Uh, but yeah, the awkward thing is that we're now declared wrong by Kong Rong as well. But I suppose, this, you know, if I keep expanding, what's he gonna do, right? Ah, fuck it. Let's just keep going. I wonder if I need to look at. Oh, right, hold on. One thing I haven't done yet is give you guys all a bunch of equipment. Definitely need to give someone, because one of these dudes is super unhappy. 
I like how all these guys are. 69, 67. Oh, I'm not very happy with my current position. Hmm. Got general discontent is normal. Lack of purpose. Desire. You're literally in an army right now, mate. What are you doing? I think that mic should be going away, though. He seems to be getting happier. Oh, I'm so fucking happy, aren't I? Okay. Um, what are you gonna get? Circle, hollow, square. I don't really care about that. But we all know that there's not really anything you want. Well, first of all, I'll start off with you, because I saw that, and I think that's what you're gonna get. Yeah, you're gonna get that one. Great. And do I have any more? Have you got any more of that uh, instinct? Sorry, not expertise, I mean, not instinct. Uh, I don't, actually. I am very sad to inform you I do not. Well, in that case, I will have some of our instinct after all. Your deployment for your infantry is pretty irrelevant. Morale for melee calf, that's fine. I guess I can give that to you. I'll seem to give out weapons. A spear. Can you, you can't use a spear, can you? No, you can't. No, you can't. Um, damage is way better on this. Expertise loses, but... Which is pretty shit, to be honest. But the other the alternative is this, which is rank as well. Yeah, there you go. Fuck it. Fuck it. Alright, so I, I haven't got any um, expertise for you. The melee, mor yeah, the morale. I think I'm just going to give that to you. So you can use the spear, I guess, since no one else is using this. Here you go. Uh, so I give to you. I give it all up for you. Um, either the cunning boat. No, I don't want that. I want this, I think. Yeah, that's pretty good. Chance of ambushing. Pretty fucking irrelevant with you guys. Get rid of deployment for your... Nope, don't want that for your archers. Why does it keep doing that? Okay, no, yeah, we'll just, we'll just give him the uh, morale for melee cat. Fuck it. And then anything else that gives cunning, like that. Or the 14 one as well. I don't really need a 14 cunning in the same place. But it's better than anything else I can give you. Then again, there's... No, that's not that. Um, are you an administrator? Probably not. It's possible that you are. You know what? No, he's actually, he is a great commander now, but that's not quite what I asked, is it? So let's just give him the, uh... No, we'll give him, we'll give him this one. Okay. Uh, you don't have a better weapon. You need... Cavalry stuff. So yeah, I'm gonna give this a 40 thing to you. And then... The bow is good for you as well, so I'll give that to you. Got it. Never remember to use it, I'll tell you that much right now. And I think you're just gonna get some instinct. Do some more damage. Alright. Fantastic. Should be happy as well now. Or I'm gonna fucking kill him. Um Yep. Wait, before I do other buildings. I don't even know if I've got enough right now. Just about that's gonna go down to like Yep, very little. Okay. And we got nothing else to do, but we have several towns we're going to take right now. If I decide to declare war on Libya. See, there's one. There's two. And yeah, we can't actually reach this one this turn. I can't reach the town though, so I guess that means I go for the town instead. Does he own that? No, he doesn't. His vassals do now. Oh my goodness. <laughs> Not a lot of people that like me doing this, but... Um, oh God, no, fuck it. I'm a yellow turban. I don't give a shit about this shit. Ooh, you're uh, someone. You are someone. You're a legendary someone. Look at you. You think you're all that or something? Alright. Build up some shit. Hope your army, or his army, isn't actually in the neighborhood, the main one, or any army for that matter. Uh, we're gonna go ahead and take this place, so did I actually switch? I think I did. You can still reach it though. That's kind of painful, but I'm not gonna siege him out, I'll just take it right now. I doubt we're gonna see any battle with this army for a little bit anyway, so that's okay. Okay. Got ourselves a new piece of equipment, because you level up. That'll be 
Research rate, I do want that. Do we have nine? Yeah, we have nine battles here, don't, don't we? I think I chose that just now, so. Um, construction time in local county and melee evasion is pretty good. I do want the research rate, but I think I'm actually going to hold off on that for now and get that one first. So I can build the buildings up here faster. Speaking of, we have an iron mine and a lumber yard, so that's income from industry, income from peasantry, which means we're going to go, I guess, not quite hand in hand here. Yeah, normally I'd say commerce and, in, and industry, but I think I'm actually going to go for peasantry. Oh, then again, this 40% income from peasantry. Don't get any money from food here. Or sorry, we don't uh, yeah, have any food buildings here. That's income from commerce. Um, hold on. So I think it is going to be industry and commerce, and then the extra peasantry income is going to be a bit random, but that's okay. So we can go for... Fishing, okay, so that one's just excluded right away. We're not going to go for that, even though that's what it currently is right now. So we can go for more income from commerce. I mean, this is the later on decision anyway, so for right now, yeah, we are converting it. And we are keeping this, I guess. That's a pretty... This is one of the shittier buildings available, I believe. And we're not going to get the food buildings. So I'm not going to keep that one. But yeah, this one is going to go... Uh, this gives extra income from spice. And loses the food altogether and 50% trade influence. Yeah, I think the trade influence is the most important part. I think the spice buildings are down. Actually, we're pretty close to those, aren't we? They're like down here somewhere, I think, the spice. Spice girls. Okay, so that army is actually going to be full soon. It's replenishing super fast. So two turns until that's full and we can go on the offensive. Although they have a full yeah, stack here and then a small one there that could maybe just run over here if they wanted to. The garrison here is trash, but probably enough to deal with that. Although that's free generals, but I could recruit some if I needed to. Our income is rank, but let's take the mine. Holy shit, the garrison here is huge. Could starve them out once more, but again, I'm just gonna take it, take the pain. Alright, so we put a proper dent into um, Liu Bia. We're gonna take this two turn replenishment we're fine against, so that's okay. Okay, I don't know how strong he actually is. He's weaker than me. Also, we have trade available. Does anyone want to trade with me? Besides that lady, you do. You're Zhang, Zhang Yan, okay. 682 is definitely worth it. I could probably make that work. Okay, maybe not as easily as I thought, but... Actually, no, yeah, we have loads of ancillaries. I always forget about that. Can I interest you, you in uh, a couple of shit ones, actually? I have loads of shit ones. Oh yeah, fucking love you some clay rats. Alright, 10 food. That's actually kind of a lot of food. I could reduce it by... 8. No, wait. By 7. And I'll give you one more shitty ancillary. That's probably better. One more shitty ancillary coming right up. Uh, oh, there you go. Shitty pig. I don't want the authority one, so that's fair enough. Alright, cool. And we got 682. That's pretty good. I do need the money, and I have no plan of attacking her, because she is uh, vassal of Yuan Shu, whom we are now happily at peace with. Um, oh, I can confederate you. Mm. So this is kind of an interesting thing, because... When I do that, I'm assuming I'm going to take, you know, I'm going to get his land, but I'm probably going to lose it immediately, because I'm at war. Well, if I hadn't declared war on uh, Liu Biao just now, I'm, that may have actually worked out. I'm still going to do it, though. And uh, we'll get his his land. I'm probably just going to, like, you know, lose the land, whatever, but I, I want the actual generals. Or maybe, actually, you know, what I could do is I'll do that, and I'll sell all of his, all of his land off. <laughs> That's not a bad idea, is it? I probably get quite a bit of money for that. Um, yeah, we'll do that. We'll probably meet all the other factions around here and literally everyone will declare war on me, but that's okay. Um, yeah, I think that's a good idea. And then we get her Yi, so we can actually have him in an army and uh, her man as well. So that'll be cool, but it'll also be next time. Let me just do this, and that should save the game. Yep, saving. Perfect. Alright, so... That'll be next time, though. We'll do that next time in the beginning of the new episode. So until then, thank you very much for watching. I hope you enjoyed. Have a good day, and goodbye.